That's right. So we're here in the Crazy Thing Art Studio uh, where Eddie Milburn does all of his work. He's working on this custom tote bag for us. He's airbrushing a skull. Eddie, how's it going so far? It's looking good. I really think it's going to be your new logo. I think I think that WLKY would appreciate that. I, I could see that on all the vans. Okay, I mean, I could too. That's a big project for you, though. Listen, I'm going to have you take a break from that so we can kind of see what other things you can airbrush on. You said pretty much anything, starting with these T-shirts. Oh, absolutely. I do uh, shirts. Hoodies are real popular. These tote bags, they're really handy for any event and anywhere you go. These retired uh, bowling balls. Those are so crazy. I mean, that looks but like an eyeball. That is nowhere near the limits. You know, craft pumpkins, Christmas ornaments. Oh, nice. And then over here, we have some pretty interesting stuff. You, These are more casual items until we get to this toilet seat. Check, <laughs> check this out. Wow. Who, who wouldn't want their own custom toilet seat? How long does it take you to make something like that? The artwork can depends on what they want. Mm -hmm. But the process alone takes a couple days to cover it and everything. Yeah. I also do ceramic tiles. These can be installed any way you want to. Wow. What's the craziest thing that someone's asked you to airbrush on that's G-rated? <laughs> <laughs> right? Uh, about everything you can imagine. Uh, really? I do bodies. Bodies? Yep. Okay. But uh, one of the biggest things I've done is a, a 40 foot banner. Okay. That was incredible. It took up the whole shop. Um, I get asked to put everything you can imagine on cars. Yeah. Uh, up here is the, is the hood of a vehicle right there. Something like that. Um, how long does that usually take you? It's the prep work and the finish work, but you're looking at a, probably a week's worth of work to do it all start to finish. It's amazing to see that you can do this stuff without a stencil. Is, does that ever get difficult for you? Depends on the subject, but things like that, no. Um, I guess I take, take it for granted that mm -hmm. I, I just see it, you know, and I kind of know where it's going and where it's leading. And, and once I get started, uh, the, the world melts away and, and I just get involved and do it until it's done. Eddie says sometimes he gets into like a trance. So what you just watched earlier is I just broke that trance because he was <laughs> in the zone painting that skull. Another really cool thing I want to ask you guys, if you had to get something painted on a toilet seat, what would it be? I mean, it's a tough one, right? <laughs> I don't know if it would be a skull in crossbones, Alex, but um, that is seriously good work. I mean, he's so talented. I like so that we cool. all started cracking up when he said that would look Spice good on the WLKY news cars. <laughs> <laughs> I, I would certainly so. make a splash. <laughs> You think maybe we could get a lightning bolt right here on the inside of the yeah, suit? Yeah, that's what I'm That'd talking cool. about. Yeah, you could track it out yeah. some yeah, chances. You could be like, oh, there's a thunderstorm right there. <laughs> thunderstorm over there. I'm getting